care who you are. After riding so long, a guy just needs to take a break. So I decided to stop here in Wayne County, take a look around. What I found was this old historic building down on the corner of 400 West and 200 South. Now the importance of this old building is that this was the old Blackburn Hotel and Livery Stable. Now after Butch Cassidy, Elsie Lay, and Bob Meeks robbed the Mount Pilger Bank in August of 1896, Butch split up from his crew and this is where he spent a few days was right here at the Blackburn Hotel in Lower Utah. Butch was seen in the foyer reading a newspaper. When asked what he was doing, he calmly replied that he was catching up on what the posse was doing looking for them outlaws that robbed the bank. Funny thing is, if they only knew, he was sitting right there in the foyer of the Blackburn Hotel in Lower Utah. Well, this building right here is all that's left of the old hotel and livery stable. But right here in this room is where Butch would have been sitting, hiding out from that Idaho posse as they was out of looking for him. Mr. A.N. McIntosh, the teller there at the bank, blamed the whole thing on the number 13. He noted that it was the 13th day of the month that occurred after the 13th deposit had been made of the day in the sum of $13, and the robbery occurred at 13 minutes after the hour of 3 o'clock. Doesn't sound to me like Butch was a very superstitious guy. Or if he was, he was proving it wrong. Well, you're, you're inside the old Blackburn Hotel and Livery Stable here. Butch Cassidy was in this room. But uh, hey, we're headed out to the roost. Got lots of miles to cover, so I'm getting back on the rope. <laughs>